My name is Jay Grams. My family has owned the Volo Auto Museum since 1960. We have a few hundred of the most exciting collector cars and they're all for sale in one location. I personally have handpicked them from around the country. Welcome to my sales shop. Come on, let's go for a spin. Man, I should just sit this one out. This car is absolutely gorgeous. I've always liked the Crown Victorias, and especially lately, our black and yellow ones parked right in front of my office. I just sit there looking at it like, man, it's got so much going on. This one here is from down south, just a good old clean car, restored beautifully, power steering. It's got a Thunderbird 292 motor, loaded with goodies, wire basket hubcaps, Continental kit, and on and on. And there's a couple surprises up its sleeve, too. They've added a air condition system and they've upgraded the original radio so it's a stereo go to volocars.com and that's where you can read all the specs study the pictures top to bottom and that's where you'll find the price if you enjoy watching the video subscribe to our youtube channel click on the bell icon you'll be notified as the new ones are posted but right now join me let's go for a spin in this 56 crown victoria Underneath the car is just very respectable, never been body off frame or restored or anything like that, but the floors look to be solid. Uh, the front end components are not caked in grease or rust. They're not brand new, but I would assume they've been rebuilt uh, not that long ago. Uh, you look up at the motor, that looks pristine. The freeze plugs, the, the oil pan bolts, everything looks really fresh on the motor. Uh, the transmission as well. There's something odd on the transmission, which you can see in our pictures. Uh, it's a Fordomatic, and I'll call it the bell housing part of it, even though automatic, I don't think they call it a bell housing, but it has a vented, uh, like to keep the transmission cool. I've been Googling for the last half hour. I couldn't find anything like that. Uh, but according to the tag on the side and the number I looked up, it is a Fordomatic, but I can't find one that looks like this one. I. Uh, I think this one had air shocks in the back, pretty sure it does. Uh, and again, just clean, proper and clean underneath there. The body is amazing. I mean, it's really straight. I, I eyeballed down each side. It's not rippled, it is straight. Uh, the tag looks like it's the original tag uh, on the car and it was born these colors inside and out. Uh, the turquoise with the colonial white. Beautiful. Uh, up front here, all of this looks like it's been replaced. The grill, the bumper, the emblems, the bird, all of this looks new. The stainless moldings are straightened and polished. They got to be new. It has dual mirrors. All the stainless all around here is either new or professionally restored. Crown Victorias have this. They call it the basket handle. All the glass looks new except the rear window looks really good original just a few light scratches you'd have to look for and all the gaskets and seals around all the windows around the vent windows that looks new we got continental or uh, continental kits coming up we have fender skirts with the stone shields and got rocker trim that's optional has reverse lights that's an option and all the trim and all that looks new See the exhaust tips coming right through the bumper. It's factory feature. All five wheels have the wire basket. That's an option. They're actually rather expensive to buy, uh, and they're in beautiful shape. They look new. This tire swings out of the way. We'll get to that in a little bit. Has the rear mount antenna, which is a real neat feature. The paint is just polished, smooth and glossy. I have not seen any problem areas. There's no cracking, there's no shrinkage, there's no uh, mismatched colors. Uh, from what I've seen so far, I won't use the word perfect, but I haven't seen a flaw yet, and I was looking for them. Uh, it's beautiful paint, and all the panels fit nice, and again, it is straight, really nice. These are Goodyear, uh, I think they're called Diamondback, uh, radial white wall tires, nice bright white walls. And it has the Thunderbird emblem on the fender. You might be thinking, well, it's not a Thunderbird. Well, it's got the Thunderbird 292 four barrel motor under the hood. The engine compartment's very neat and orderly. It's stock, it has Thunderbird on the valve covers also, the right air cleaner. It's the original teapot 
uh, four barrel, they call it. Uh, it looks like it has a flamethrower coil, uh, power steering, the air conditioning, you wouldn't even notice it's there. You see a compressor, and that's all you see. Batteries bolted down, new cables, the wiring harness looks new. It has the bag for the washer fluid. So it's not like brand new concourse, but it's really nice and respectable. I was also born with the matching uh, turquoise and white interior. I think they call it peacock blue, actually. Uh, but the door panels have all been replaced, all the upholstery, uh, carpet, matching floor mats. This is how the tire swings away. And then there's your gas. You can get to that. The headliner is a white perforated headliner, and it's really cool because the same chrome trim you see here is on the inside. It's duplicated inside, which is, which is cool. Steering wheels restored. The air conditioning unit's just neatly below the dash. The radio, it's not a stereo, retro stereo. It's an actual original radio. It has modern guts. I just turned it on. It plays beautifully. Uh, it's stereo. So all the instruments, gauges, bezels, uh, the mirror, the visors, all look like new. The paint inside is just as slick as the outside. Door jams are painted real slick. Sill plates look new. The metal is all clean in here, under the hoods painted. Yeah, all real nice. I'm going to pop the trunk, and then I'll hop in it and start it up. The emblem back here in the trunk. Looks new. You open it up, it looks nice. It has a nice gray and white plaid mat. It has a white wall tire. It's never actually been used on a, a blue rim. It's got the jack assembly. Everything's painted nice. The weather strip looks new. The seat divider looks new. Got seat belts in the front. The knobs look like they've been replaced. You have to put these in neutral to start them. Oh, it has Flowmaster mufflers. I forgot to mention that. So it has a little rumble. I can tell the instruments are lighting up right now. The heater control panel's lit up. really nice car. The more I looked at it, it's like got better and better. I like it when that happens. Car's got style, man. This is this is a beauty. Fifty-six Ford Crown Victoria, flashy and trashy with all the options, all the trim, great colors. That's my impression of this one. If you go to volocars.com, there's plenty of ways to contact the salesman. They'll be happy to answer specific questions or concerns you might have. They can get you financed and get this delivered to your driveway. Go to volocars.com to get started. If you just enjoy watching the video, subscribe to our YouTube channel, click on that bell icon, and you'll be notified as the new ones are posted. Thanks for watching.